hello hello welcome back to my channel it is me it is i it is she it is her it is the it is who it is rosie rosette 2020 pal how are you guys doing today i'm i'm doing okay i'm a little stressed out about some dealings that i have tomorrow <sighs> um but you know and then i just ate some wasabi almonds let me tell you if you want to kick and i am addicted i could I could literally probably eat a whole bag, which would not be good because it's a lot of salt. It's a lot, 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 lot of salt. Anyway, it is me, it is I, it is she, it is her, it is the, it is who. Ow, it's right here. Hurts. Mm. I hope I'm not, you think I'm having a heart attack or something? I don't know, wait a minute. All right. It hurts right here. Um, it is me, it is I, it is she, it is her. See, you know what? I think it's those wasabi almonds. I, I'm gonna have to stop buying those. This is my last bag. I'm gonna buy, I'm not buying no more wasabi because I think it's 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 detrimental. I don't know. Anyway, um, okay, for the third time, it, it is me, it is I, it is she, it is her, it is the it is who it is, Rosie Rosette 2020 pal. How are you guys doing? I'm doing fine. Guess what? Guess what month it is? Guess, 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 guess. No, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, get okay, okay. It's October. What's happening in October? Yes, we know about Halloween. Yes, we know about Halloween. But guess what else is happening? Guess, guess. Yes, it is National Breast Cancer Awareness Month. You know what? They're having a little party at the um, bus stop across the street from where I live. And I'm just, you know, I don't know just would like to understand what's going on anyway ladies and gentlemen with boobies please go and get your tatas checked what do i mean by tatas check please go get a mammogram yes i know the first video i said a sonogram and then i said instagram i mean a monogram oh should we read about what a mammogram is is it mammo or mono i think it's mammogram mammogram I love me some Google. I need to get a job. It's just right up the street. Well, they got Googles everywhere, but still. Okay, let's see. Mammogram. Mama. Mammogram. Mammogram. All right. Okay. Don't allow. Mammogram. Okay, what is a mammogram? A mammogram is an x ray pictures of the breast. Doctors use a mammogram to look for early stages no i'm sorry for early signs of breast cancer regular mammograms are the best test are the best test for what come on let's finish it up let's finish it up um regular mammograms are the best tests doctors have to find breast cancer early sometimes up to three years before it can be felt early is the operative phrase early um are you worried about the cost? CDC offers free low cost mammograms. The CDC. So you guys can look up free or low cost mammograms. So again, um, you know, it, they're out there and they're free. Please invest in yourself. I understand that, you know, we are all going through it. Listen, baby, I babies, ladies, nieces, sisters, whatever brothers bros whoever i understand about the struggle believe me don't let these cheap wigs and all this makeup fool you don't let all this junk fool you honey i know a struggle oh yes i understand i, I saw the lady today um i was recycling bottles and um, i saw this lady she just reminded me of me and my son when you know he was little whatever she was you know thin and all that yes i used to be thin um especially when i first had him oh my god i was so small mm. anyway and i was like you know i just said she was my son's age actually i said i know it's hard i said but don't give up keep going her son was so cute he was tall my son was short for a long time and then um he grew he's like taller i mean he's not you know like six five or anything but he's like six one six two whatever he um he's like skying over all, like all of his cousins who were you know way bigger than him or whatever he's like taller than all of them but his father's tall anyway go get your mammograms please 
I know it's a struggle. I know, I know, I know, I know. I can split a penny. Oh, yes, I can split a penny. Oh, baby, I don't see restaurants. I don't go out to restaurants often. Um, I, I can... <laughs> I spend it, but... Do I know how to budget? I don't know. You don't have to do that for a mammogram, okay? You don't have to do that. They have low cost and free mammograms. All you have to do is research. Ladies, this is very important. This is very vital to your livelihood. I mean, mostly all women have breasts, okay? Especially when you're 52. They, you know, they sag. They, you know, gravity pulls them down. But they're yours. And if you can catch it three years before you can fill it you can probably save excuse me i'm just so it's those wasabi <laughs> it's those wasabi um i have wasabi almonds and apple juice i would like for that to be my dinner but you know those late night snacks i don't know but anyway i'm rambling you guys just have to get it i mean after October, I'm not, I'm not, I can't do this. I can't advocate, you know, that my, my shoulder, my arms hurting or whatever, you know, these wigs. I'm so sick of pink wigs. Please go get your mammograms. Okay. All right. Now back to schedule programming. Okay. Now I did look at Wendy Williams a bit. You know, I'm always busy now when she comes on and yes, she's, you know, it's tape, but I just, if I don't see it at 10 or whatever, I just like, I, I just can't stop. I can't sit down and watch Wendy's show anymore. I can't. If she's not on it, I can't watch it. It's something about her, you know, remember when I used to do, you know, like every show and I would, you know, critique her fashion and talk about her shoes. I said this in another video. It's not the same, you know, because, you know, I will go from her hair to her makeup, to her clothing, to her shoes, to her tatas and titties. Okay, here I got mine. Yes, I, I got mine too. Mine's are real. There's no additives or anything. Um, I'm not saying hers are fake, but mine's are real. <sighs> I think those wasabi almonds got me feeling it. I think it's too much salt. My body's like, whoa. Anyway. I just, I'm not in awe of anyone else. Like, they're saying that, what's her name, Remini, whatever her name is, that they want her back. No, I want Wendy back. I don't want, I don't want nobody but Wendy. You know what I'm saying? Unless you got some eye candy for me. Nick Cannon, oh Lord, that's a piece. Ooh, Nick is a piece. Oh, he's so fine and handsome. And he can hang a suit. Lord, ooh, that Nick, Nick Cannon. Anyway. If, it, if it's not Nick Cannon, then it has to be Wendy. There's like either A or B. Now, we got Nick Cannon. Okay, fine. We got him at 11. We need Wendy back. We need, there's no other. Like, it is the Wendy Williams show. That's who we need. No. Now, they did have a little sassy, um, <laughs> healthy woman today. With her afro... She had character. She did have character. Now, that's one thing, you know, I did like. She did have character, even though I couldn't sit and watch her. Um, and then she had, there was another lady with like a orange hair color. I was like, well, hell, I can do that. I can get on the Wendy Show. You guys really need to, you know, ask me to come or whatever. But I don't want the position. I'm just saying I, I could probably fill it. I, I, I could. I could. I could, you know, put on my grown-up voice and, you know whatever I you know what I'm saying I got the wigs or whatever I got the cheat cheese or whatever you know um, the stomach or whatever you know whatever anyway I don't want it I want Wendy back you know it's just the way her presence you know when she comes in and then the door opens and then you know she you know like kind of trots out and you know the boobies and titties is you know whatever and then she has on the skirt and you know, she's kind of, you know, very feminine and very ladylike or whatever. And then, you know, she twirls or whatever. And, you know, everybody, it's just her energy. It's just, it's, it's the Wendy show. And only Wendy, like, should be in it. Did Oprah ever have anyone guest host for her? No, no. But did, 
Well, we don't know if Oprah has some habit. I think she does. I think Oprah allegedly probably. You know, she. I think she smokes a little. I wouldn't be surprised if she, you know, had a, a problem. Or, you know what I'm saying? They all do. They all do. This is whatever. You know, I'm sure, you know, I don't know. Does Oprah drink? It doesn't matter. She's made her money. She's made, you know, own and, you know, she's, you know, she got her money, whatever. So whatever she did or whatever she's doing, she's already made it. So it doesn't matter. I'm sure she doesn't care what y'all think about her. Um, she didn't, I don't think Oprah had a, I think it would go to reruns, reruns, reruns. But didn't she do like two or three shows in one day? just know what else is going on because definitely there is something going on and you know everyone's saying that she's not coming back and I put on my video that she is coming back I just can't wait when wait until she does but and I'm gonna stand on that because if she wasn't coming back then it wouldn't be the Wendy Williams show they would cut and have someone you know another show in there with all the talent in the world I don't understand okay no, that's not that's not that's not the direction I want to go um, there's no other like Wendy Williams and there will er never be. There's something that gravitates us to, you know, is it she like 5'11", you know, big boobs, lanky, tennis shoe wearing, you know, whatever. You know what I'm saying? There's just something unique about it and it's irreplaceable. It is. Uh... more stars won't go on Wendy okay there's Wendy of old and then there's Wendy of new I, I I don't get it why has Cardi B been on Wendy Williams you know like there's a plethora of stars Did, has Beyonce ever been on Wendy Williams you know like come on you guys you know did a has a Shante you know whatever and it's like okay so uh, Wendy may ask some questions okay and you know well you know, everything can't be rosy or whatever, you know, literally. Um, so what? Like, why? You know, if I was someone's manager, I'd be like, go oh, get your, you know, that's free publicity, PR, whatever. Let go, go. go. <laughs> I don't know why I keep doing that. But, you know, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I like this set the two people two ladies that were here today better than the witch and what is it leah remini whatever i just well you know she talks through her nose i cannot stand when people talk through their nose like is everybody does everybody have allergies or you know allegedly i mean how many people didn't hit the pipe that everybody's nozzle passages oh like no up and they talk like this i can't i can't stand it i cannot stand it and watch them never I mean i have to talk like this but i cannot stand it. I, I i'll turn it off i just want wendy back yeah i'm not asking for much it's her show i understand she got some health problems okay i get it let us know the real real you know what I'm saying? Like, let us know whatever it is, because it's it's a lot more than Graves' disease. Is it? Is it her hobbies? Is it the drinking hobbies? Like, whatever it is, can we let us know? Okay, she won't be back until Thanksgiving. Oh wait, <laughs> I guess they did tell us, you know, give us dates, and those didn't work out. Where's her dad? Dad, you need to go see your daughter. Like, I was thinking about this the other day. Remember when her and her father? I mean, the mother and the father used to always come to show what happened. I mean, I understand he's getting old in age. He should be about 87, 77. No, I think he's 80 and he's eight in his 80s. Yeah. You know what? That's not my business as to why. As to the why. The brother and the sister. And I, I saw something that the son was partying in LA he should be he's 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 you know he's a young man he is not his fault that you know his mama and his daddy had whatever that's on them that's their problem that ain't got nothing to do with him it has nothing to do with him as long as he keeps a straight and narrow which you know as a child he won't because that's what kids do you know okay but he has to you know walk a careful line 
matches. I hope nothing really happens to me. And I don't think it is. I, I, I just don't know. I'm just kind of like, okay, well, what's really going on now? Well, what's really the reason why she ain't, you know what I'm saying? Why, why she ain't doing nothing? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Take care, Wendy. All right. Bye.